So let me give you a how to work your way through this trap. All right, how do I break the cycle? And this is where mindfulness kicks in. So we talked about this process um, last month. But the first thing to understand, if I want to break out of this cycle, knowing that I'm, my feelings create my thoughts, and my thoughts create my feelings, and sometimes the other way around, I can get trapped in that. What I want to do then is connect to the present moment. And one of the simplest ways you can do that is to find an anchor, okay? And, and you don't have to be quiet or anything, you just need to find an anchor. The, the most convenient anchor for people is their breathing, yeah? If I get all these thoughts and emotions in my head, I need to bring everything down to my body. And the best place to do that, get out of my head and into my body so I can use an anchor of breathing. Some people use an external anchor. They have pictures, they have a flame, whatever. But I'm saying the most convenient one that you can carry around is your breathing. So you just take that concept of breathing. So I connect to the present moment. I'm just gonna concentrate on my breathing for now. I'm, sh I'm trapped in here. If I get away from that and concentrate on my breathing, I'm able to allow feelings to be present. So all of a sudden, the feelings that are coming through, instead of me being on the train of feeling, I can be the train station watching the train of feeling. So I can then watch these feelings come without being part of it. Because I'm not thinking about it, I'm not processing it, I'm just breathing. So that's the, the, the step. Breathe, concentrate on your breathing. Or I like to say to people, slow down your breathing, a count of eight. All right, and then if you watch, uh, one of the simplest things about breathing, and, and this takes a bit of exercise to do, is to breathe out your belly and not lift your shoulders. Yeah, that's the first thing. So whenever, um, as a practice, if you guys want to do this properly, the first thing to do is just breathe like we did when we were babies. And that is to fill our stomach. Actually, we're not filling our stomach, but pushing our stomach out. Yeah, a lot of the times when people, adults do this now, they breathe like this. So they're not actually getting air to the bottom of their lungs. Everything's up here. So everything kind of stays up here. And so tension and, and anxiety is still kind of wanting to push up to the head. I'm saying drop everything down as low as you can. So breathe down and then while you're thinking about your breathing, allow the emotions to come. And because you're allowing them to come, you're allowing them to leave as well. Yeah? And then while that's happening, what will happen is that because you're thinking about your breathing, you will notice when you stop thinking about your breathing and you're thinking about something else. That's the thing about concentrating on an anchor. Once you know you've dropped the anchor, you kind of go, oh, that's right, then I've got to get back to my anchor. And that's the routine, the four steps to breaking the cycle. By the time you process this in three minutes, you'll be out of the trap. That's what I have to do when I start crying. Yeah? Because I get massive headaches. Yeah. So I have to breathe. Tension. And then I just find concentrating on that. So then I start to think, oh, what am I crying over? Why? Yeah. yeah, so I go through that hole. Yeah, good. Yeah. It, it is, um, like, we, like I said, it, it is an effective way. And, and for all of us, uh, that get caught in this trap. When we do, it is one way you can get out. Like I said, it's, it, it, it can take three minutes, I mean, sometimes it takes longer, but three minutes is a really good time frame to give it. Um, but that, that's, I don't know how many laps that is of an eight breath session, but I've never actually counted. But that's all it is. Slow your breathing down, take eight counts to breathe in and eight counts to breathe out. All right, let the feelings come as you're thinking about the breathing. When you stop thinking about breathing, be aware of it and go back to it. And in three minutes time, you'll settle. Your brain will stop looping and you'll hotwire uh, the next place, which then directs what action you're going to take. So that pretty much completes our session, which I've timed beautifully today. I'm very happy with that.